Welcome to a lesson on how to determine the volume of a right circular cylinder and the volume of a square pyramid. The volume of a solid is equal to the number of unit cubes that will fit inside the solid. Looking at the right circular cylinder, notice how the lengths are given in centimeters and therefore the volume is equal to the number of cubic centimeters that will fit inside the solid. To determine the volume of a right circular cylinder, we use the formula V equals pi times R squared times H, where V is the volume, R is the radius, and H is the height. Notice the radius, R is equal to six centimeters, and the height, H, is equal to 12 centimeters. And therefore, the volume V is equal to pi times six squared times 12. We'll determine the exact volume in terms of pi and also get a decimal approximation using an approximation for pi. So the volume V is equal to pi times six squared is 36, 36 times 12 is equal to 432, and therefore the exact volume is 432 pi, and the units are cubic centimeters. And now we'll use the calculator to get a decimal approximation for this volume. Often we use 3.14 as an approximation for pi, but this calculator also has a pi key or a pi button, so we'll show both approximations, and we'll see they will be slightly different. Using 3.14 for pi, we have 432 times 3.14, which gives an approximation of 1,356.48 cubic centimeters. Now let's use the pi key which will give us a more accurate approximation because the pi key uses more decimal places to approximate pi. We would have 432 times pi to access pi we press second and then the caret or exponent key and enter. Using the pi key, the approximation is approximately 1,357.17 cubic centimeters. I'm gonna go ahead and use the more accurate approximation using the pi key. So the approximation again is 1,357.17 cubic centimeters. So this tells us that just over 1,357 cubic centimeters will fit inside the cylinder. And now let's determine the volume of the square pyramid. We're given the volume formula V equals one-third times the length times the width times the height, this formula can be used to determine the volume of a pyramid as long as the base is a rectangle. Remember, all squares are rectangles. So for the pyramid, the length is equal to six meters, and so is the width, and the height is equal to 15 meters. The volume is equal to the number of cubic meters that will fit inside the pyramid. Using the volume formula, we have the volume V equals one-third times six meters times six meters times 15 meters, which gives us one-third times six, which is equal to two. Two times six is 12, and 12 times 15 is 180. The volume is equal to 180 cubic meters, which means exactly 180 cubic meters will fit inside the square pyramid. I hope you found this helpful.